Joe Lacob has announced that no one will wear his jersey number 35. Do you feel like that's a genuine move? No, I think it was just uh, it's a cover. Up. It's something that he has to do. I think because they dropped the ball from top to bottom. And I'm glad you brought that up because when I was on y'all show a couple weeks ago during the finals, I said that I thought it wasn't a calf strain from the beginning. I mm -hmm. thought that, and you know, even though if KD went out and got second opinions or whatever the case may be, I think the Warriors medical staff, I think the front office, I think they dropped the ball. And then all of a sudden, you have a guy in Andre Iguodala who comes out on the Breakfast Club and kills the medical staff and says how they misdiagnosed him also and how he was playing on a, I guess, a, 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 a fractured foot. And they was telling him that he could play when he really wasn't supposed to be playing. So, um, you know, Kirk, I think did you they talk owe to KD, that. Did you talk to KD about that when Iggy came out? Oh, uh, I did. Um, and he, 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 he said it didn't surprise him. Uh, and when Iggy made the statement, all of a sudden Iggy got traded. So, I mean, but I think Joe Lacob and the ownership owed it to Kevin Durant um, to retire. I think it's just, you know, it's more so, uh, in my opinion, it's a sign of guilt. Hmm. I wouldn't go that far. I wouldn't go that why far. It's his opinion. Tell me why. Opinion. Opinion. Hold, hold on. Yeah, I would tell you why. I would tell you why. Because by saying it's a sign of guilt, you're actually knocking down your own argument about KD and the greatness of KD and why they should have appreciated that. This guy went there. He was two, he won two NBA championships, back-to-back -back NBA Finals MVP, three consecutive trips to the NBA Finals. There are cats that have been in the league for 20 years that have never won a ring. He delivered right. two in three years and three trips to the Finals. And, oh, by the way, had he not gotten injured – he would he would have won a third. So if you can see that and I can see that, why can't the ownership for the Golden State Warriors, who, by the way, offered him a super max of $221 million, despite his injury and everything else, not just sit back and say, you know what? This dude is great, and we got to retire that jersey because that this brother and, was something special and, for us. And why, listen, why is that guilt? Why can't that just be appreciation? And listen, and I mean, and it can be, Stevie, you right, but I'm just going back, and I'll take you all the way back to the Oklahoma City days. The Oklahoma City, look at what Kevin Durant did for that franchise. And they never said, not one time did OKC, I mean, he never delivered a ring, but he obviously is in the, he's obviously, his they jersey. They never retired never his jersey yeah, number either. Perk, I don't think it's guilt. That's, Perk, I don't think it's guilt. I think it's just smart. You have yeah. to show the league. Hey, if you yep, come here, because well, he didn't choose to go to OKC. He chose to go to Golden State. That's right. You got to show I the agree, league, look, I we're going to treat you right. We're going to retire That's your right. number. I get right that he got yet. two right. rings, guys, but he was only there a couple years. By so the there's way, also that yeah. argument. And a, and a credit to Golden State. Think about this. Toronto wins despite all the injuries. KD goes down. Clay goes down. Iguodala gets hurt in game one, even though he still played the center. What do they do? They take out a full-page ad in Toronto. You know, congratulations. You beat us. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I mean, sometimes it's just about doing the right yeah. thing. I think they got to right, give right. you got to give them credit for that. After they may have done the wrong right, thing right. in terms of the, yeah, you're right. the the environment of expectation that KD would come back. Real quick, the head performance therapist Chelsea Lane was not paid what she wanted, and so she left. And all of a sudden, everyone got hurt. Have you heard anything right. about that perk? Has anyone said anything about that to you from the Warriors? Well, I just heard that they should have killed. They should have found. They said that. She was the best thing for their organization, and they let her go. And from my understanding, I uh, over the last five years, I think their medical staff has been switched out. They have switched in, people in and out over the last three to four years. So, I mean, that speaks volume. And Iggy said it himself. This is a guy that was in the locker room. This is a guy that went through it. So, I mean, you know, that's dead bird tall grass now because KD is in Brooklyn. I know mm. Stephen A. Smith, you don't want to hear that, but you can switch over and become a Nets fan. No, 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 no. Listen, 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 listen. They're I, the New York team. I'm, I'm hurting because of the <laughs> New York Knicks, but I'll admit, if you ain't going to the Knicks, I ain't got no problem with the Nets. I mean, they're in Brooklyn. I got a lot of love for that organization, but I'm a lifelong Knicks fan, Stephen and it breaks my heart that the Knicks don't have a damn thing to show for free agency and 70-plus yeah. million in cash. Perk, this is the same dude uh, who we... talks about Cowboys fans, America's team, please, right. how right. it represents mediocrity, right. New York. 
York City. They have the nerve to call themselves the New York Knicks. Tama, New tama, York, tama, tama. Stephen oh. A. Max, Kendrick, <laughs> Shane. Kendrick, Kendrick. For Ma Shane. Hold, on, hold on, Max. Kendrick, Max is right. Here's the problem. You know what a sellout he is because he's saying they, and he's a New York native. And he's a New York native. Brooklyn Nets. You know if saying? you root for a New York team, root you know for the saying? real team, the Brooklyn Nets. I understand that, but I'm just saying, well, you say well, they, a... they, they, they. You yeah. from New York? No, but, I gave up the Knicks when Stephen, I moved to but LA. Look, but Stephen A. Smith, I feel how you feel because I'm a Cowboys fan. So I, trust me, You're I know a Cowboys how fan? you feel right now. You're a Cowboys Die fan? Hard. Get the yes, hell off the show. Get the <laughs> hell off the show. I don't even want to see Texas you again. Right I, he's a Cowboys fan. <laughs> you Right now. Oh my God, you're a Cowboys fan. You got to go. You can't be on this show. Bye. Bye. Steve, Steve, don't do it. Bye. Her don't thanks for always keeping it real. Oh, oh, I appreciate you. you. Don't let oh, them talk oh, you out of it. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, Max, you should be doing that today, man. <laughs> thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports, highlights, and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN Plus right now.